What's the difference? That's the question we're answering today. And we recently received this email that was perfect for this topic. Marcy in Chicago writes, our pediatrician said our seven-year-old has lactose intolerance. Is that just an allergy to milk or is it something different? And will she ever be able to have milk products? Love this question because lactose intolerance, totally different than a milk allergy. Mm -hmm. Two completely different things. What's the difference? I'm gonna try to show you through this demo. So lactose intolerance means that you have a deficiency in the enzyme lactase, meaning that you can't, you can't digest milk. And so what you're gonna see here is doesn't even mix. You, the milk and the lactose stays mm -hmm. in your GI tract. So lactose intolerance is you're intolerant to milk. Milk allergy is different. Your body can actually absorb the milk products, as you're seeing here, mm -hmm. but when it absorbs it, you have an allergic response to milk proteins. So think of this more like the other allergies we've talked about, nut allergies, mm -hmm. egg allergies, where you might have hives, other rash. You could, in some severe cases, develop difficulty breathing. So this yeah. is the one where you can truly have a life-threatening reaction. Exactly, with, you know, with lactose intolerance, generally your, your symptoms are confined to the gut. All right, and it's pretty common, about 30 million Americans <clears throat> will have lactose intolerance, and it happens in kids too, but usually when they're older. We usually don't see this happen until kids are like after age five or so, whereas uh, uh, milk allergy uh, is a little less common. About 4% of adults will be, be allergic to milk, and we see that if, if a child is allergic to milk, uh, milk protein, they usually outgrow it as they get older. About age, age three, they outgrow it, and then they're fine. And the good news here is that there are options. If you're lactose intolerant, mm -hmm. there are things like rice milk, almond, almond milk, milk, and there's there's non-dairy milk out there. Mm -hmm. If you have a you know if you have a true milk allergy, there are quasi type of milks right. that Other you can types try. Of milk. um, if you have a milk allergy, I can't emphasize this enough. Just like if you have a nut allergy, other severe food allergy, carry an EpiPen with you. I have seen EpiPens save lives because if you don't have one, you have a severe allergic reaction because yeah. milk can be in products you don't expect. Mm -hmm. So everywhere. carry an EpiPen with you just in case. Very important. So do you want to have some lactose intolerance? Why don't you chug that for me? Sure. You dare, no we'll way. check back in with you later <laughs> yeah. in the show. And then we'll have a, a vomiting segment. <laughs>